Bismillah rahman rahim In this video session, I will teach you how you will traverse a string and how you will find out a string palindrome. Let's start the lecture. Write a Python program that will ask to enter the string and traverse it from left to right and then right to left and print it on single character on each line. For example, you have input a string that is computing knowledge. If you will calculate the length of computing knowledge, it will give you 19. Length of this string that is computing knowledge is 19. And these are the array index. Array index starts from 0 and minus 1. Array index starts from 0 to onward. And you can also represent in terms of negative index but at the last in last character should be start from minus one minus one minus two and so on first character of the array will get last index in negative suppose in this case minus 19 c will get minus 19. i have written a main method here okay this is underscore Okay, two underscore, first underscore, then again another underscore, two underscore, then name, if name equal equal to main, then you will enter the string and string will be stored into variable my string and then I am writing a function, I am calling a function, function name is string index and I am passing one variable that contain the string entered string and variable name is my string i have written a program def string index this is the name of the method and parameter name is my string length i am calculating the length of my string it will be stored length into variable length and for x in range 0 to length it will move from 0 to length for example if you are entering computing knowledge and the uh, length of computing knowledge is 19 it will move from 0 to 18 okay after this it will get one by one character from the entered string and it will display on a single line okay i want to run this program enter the string i'm entering here shahzad and it will show me s h a h z a d set character by character now i am writing another function the function name is string traverse in a string traverse this is the name of the function string traverse and my string is the parameter that contains the entered string and now i am calculating the length of that string and print left to right and right to left this is just only message Okay, for x in my string, okay, this is a variable x and it will, it will approach to my string, what is in my string, it will move till, till that length and print x and in the first it will give the space and then x, x mean that is the value in my string the first suppose first character then second character then third character so on and in other side it will string the my string okay my string but no length minus one it will start from length minus one and length equal to length minus one i am giving a decrement in the loop now i am going to run this program suppose I am entering Shahzad. It will display me Shahzad in first as it is, and then left to right S H A H Z A D, and then right to left D A H Z H A H S. Okay, in this way, left to right and right to left. Program number two: write a program in Python that asks to enter the string and check that it is palindrome or not. For palindrome, suppose if you have entered a string is civic, then it will store on zero index of zero to four. Okay, and when I will get 
when I will reverse this string mean first of all I will get the last element and last element will stored into in other string in other list the yeah, and the last element will become the first element of in other list after this I V I and C now I have I start the pick I start uh, the characters to pick from the right to left when I uh, when I uh, pick the character from left from right to left or you can say in reverse order the string becomes the same as before okay this is called palindrome and suppose now you have entered another string string name is string or mean string what's the strings you know you have entered the string is string okay it will first g n i r t and s now this string is different the previous string the upper string and uh, the first one string and the other string is different we can say this is non plundrum I have written a main method this is main function in main function I am getting one string and that string is stored into variable my string and now I am calling one method that method name is sliced string okay and I am passing one parameter where that parameter belongs to that string and then it will return one value and that value will be stored into the reverse string that value will be stored into the reverse string now I am going to define a slice string method now this is slice string method okay and it takes one parameters my string and I am calculating the length and what I am doing I am moving from this is I have written my string length and this scope of, scope of resolution okay what it will do it will give all the it will get the value from the length what is the last value of the length to minus one okay length to minus one and it will make the slices and it will reverse and will put into the variable slice and after this I'm going to return this slice now here I have written print enter string is your entered string is into variable my string and your reverse string in is in variable rev string and now I am checking if my string equal equal to rev string then it will give me message string is palindrome otherwise it will display me message string is not palindrome now I want to run this program suppose I am entering my name they're entering Entered string is Shahzad and reverse string is D A H D A Z H A H S and by first string and this string both strings are different that's why it shows me string is not palindrome I will run it again now I'm going to run with a palindrome suppose civic now entered string is civic and reverse string is also civic and string is palindrome now we can say this is palindrome thanks students if you like my video please subscribe my channel thank you jazakallah khair